You know, I see her as a decent person who's had to deal with something incredibly complicated that is not easy to unravel. So she is attempting to unravel it. And it's one of those things that's so complicated that you might never be able to unravel it. And that is also uh, something she's having to contend with. She's a, a mix of conflicts. <laughs> and at this moment in her life, she's looking to live and to live with permission in whatever chapter she chooses to move forward in. But the reality of actually that being possible is, as we all probably <laughs> know in our own lives, is it's harder and um, you have to go on a journey with that. But she has a huge strength and she's a fighter. But when you threaten me into not divorcing you, that is exactly why we have to get divorced. And I am going to divorce you, okay? I am. I am. The most important thing about Harper for me is something that really comes hugely from Jessie. Uh, and it's to do with how she reacts to some of the things that she encounters. And I just thought that Jessie's choices were really interesting. Almost the best example of a collaborator making the thing better. Shall I show you around? Yeah. She'll often say, let me try this, and then she'll do something which is really quite complicated and executed perfectly and just a first-rate, top-class actor. What I've been sort of most struck by with Jessie Buckley is this sort of complete lack of self-consciousness that she has. I genuinely think she is like the most exciting actress at the moment in Britain. She is completely unique, completely rooted in everything that she's doing but with a freedom that just feels arresting and fresh. Hello. Hi. Mrs. Marlowe, yes? Harper, yes. Do, come in. The words I have to say. It's a beautiful well be simple, house. But true. Will it just be you staying, or? Excuse me? Mrs. Marlowe? No. no. Until you give your love, there's nothing more that we can do. Apple from the garden? Y yeah, it was delicious. No, 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 no. Mustn't do that. Forbidden fruit. Oh, God, sorry, I... I I'm I, joking. I... Oh. Tormented. It feels more like... Haunted. Yeah. Something happened. My husband went upstairs to our balcony and let himself go. You must wonder why you drove him to it. Why? Well, I didn't drive him to it. I thought it would be true. But if you had given him the chance to apologize... He'd still be alive. What? A man followed me out of the woods. He was stalking me. What makes you say that? I saw him twice. Twice? I don't know if he saw you once. Play a game. You hide. I'll see. You must feel an awful sense of guilt. Stay away from me. What are you doing? What are you? Oh.